Good morning, Hank. It's two. He's here. How do you like the poster behind you, by the way? It's pretty cool. It's a lot of apps. It's Question Tuesday, the day that we answer real questions from real nerd fighters. We're a little tired, but we're gonna get right to it. How much do you love each other? Oh. Yeah. Mm. I mean, that's a lot of question. That's fine. Hank, is there a secret code in the building pages of an absolutely remarkable thing? There are these little boxes and squares atop some of the buildings and dashes <laughs> in other places. It seemed intentional, or am I just no. overthinking this? You're overthinking that. There are no uh, Easter eggs at all inside the end it papers. didn't say that. What? Hey, John, yep. how do I vote in every state? Oh, you should probably look at Hank Green's amazing project, How to Vote in Every State. I so admire that, like, in the two weeks before your book came out, you were working on how to vote in every <laughs> well, state. I had a lot of help. If you need to learn how to register, you need to know the voting laws in your state, you need help understanding how to yeah. vote. Just Sample check it out. ballots, all the stuff, polling places. Everything. Monica asks, what's next for the two of you? Bed. What's John's favorite quote from Hank's book and Hank's favorite quote from John's book? Oh, definitely my favorite quote from your book is, I had a very happy childhood, but I was not a very happy child. The one I stole from you. Well, I'll tell you my favorite quote from a John Green book yeah. is, Imagining the future is a kind of nostalgia, which is really good. And I stole from my wife. <laughs> I did give Hank permission. I did, I asked. For the record. Yeah. What characters in An Absolutely Remarkable Thing are you guys most similar to? April... And Andy. What do I want to be most similar to? April and Andy. <laughs> There's some glitter on your face. I'm sorry. Oh, it's from the it's yeah. from the poster, and I'm not going to apologize for it. All right. Well, I'll just leave it there. Also, I was snuggling with Alice, and she is always just like covered in <laughs> glitter. Hey, Hank. Mm. If you were a tortoise, which one would you be? I think I'd be the kind that eats a lot of carrots. Do you think there's like some tortoises that some tortoises think are really like hyper fast tortoises and they're like, yes. dude, Larry, chill. Yeah, got Larry, enough. We get it. You can put your head out of the shell. You can put your head into the shell. Calm he, he down. Ate like, he ate like a whole carrot this hour. Now that you're both the author one, what will be your one word differential? I'm the science one and he's the old one. Who is better at signing their name? Faster. Significantly more attractive signature. Strawberry jelly or blueberry jelly? Grape, Grape jelly. jelly. There's more glitter. There's some right here. It's fine. I mean, it's part. It's just part of being Alice's dad. <laughs> Why isn't there absolutely remarkable thing merch? There is. It's at dftba.com. What are you doing? Just seeing how far I can go. Just you know what? Go. All, this is it. This is the last shot of the video. <laughs> Hank, I'll see you on Friday. Ow. You all right? Yeah. Oh, hello there. That wasn't actually the last shot of the video. Greetings from the future. Two things. First, even though my part of the Absolutely Remarkable Thing tour has ended, you should still go see Hank. He's great. And secondly, this Sunday I will be profiled on the American television show 60 Minutes, so if you're interested, you should check it out. This is Quadragacon 2018. <laughs> it's just about core strength. Oh, God. Oh. Oh. Nope. 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 <laughs>